Is Lawrence finally showing some character growth? Hi everyone, hope you are enjoying your life. Your boy Al is here with Spice and Wolf episode 21 review so let's go. At first we see Hollow and Lawrence visit a tavern in Terrio Village, where the guests praise the tavern's mistress, Lima, while drinking with Lawrence. Lima greets Lawrence and his companions, sharing a tale involving herself, a count, and some pirates before departing. Lawrence then chats with the other patrons, bringing up the village's blessings. The mood shifts, and one man mentions they owe a lot to Father Franz, but warns that it would be unwise to disobey Lord Trio, the village's deity who ensures their bountiful harvests. With how things are building up, I think Hollow might end up clashing with another supernatural being during this arc. Also I think Lima might play a key role here, given the fact that she seems to know a lot of things. We see Lawrence speculate if Trio might be a wolf god, but another man corrects him, saying Trio is a snake god. The men then tell Lawrence about a supposedly cursed cave near Enbridge Town and discuss topics like a church building deal involving Trio and punitive taxes. They ask Lawrence if he knows anyone powerful in the church who could help them pressure Enbridge to back off. Before the situation escalates, Lima intervenes, saying she wants her customers to be happy and to spread good word about the people of Terrio and other towns. Lawrence getting warned by Lima that he won't be welcomed if he gets involved in internal matters, and others asking Lawrence for recommendation is kinda contradicting, and it's making me wonder if they're having an internal dispute or something like that. Moving on we see Lima informs Lawrence that Hollow has passed out from drinking too much. Lawrence decides to take Hollow to the inn. At the inn, the innkeeper gives them some fruit to help with Hollow's hangover. The next morning, Hollow complains about not liking the fruit. While she rests, Lawrence ponders how the villagers in Terrio earn their money and considers the church's miracles. He then notices Evan leaving Terrio's church. Lawrence tells Hollow he's heading out to gather information about the abbey they're searching for. He visits Evan at his mill, where Evan agrees to turn his wheat into flour. I agree with Lawrence that Terrio seems to be quite financially stable even though the villagers are pretty carefree, which is kinda impossible, because people need to work hard to make a place financially stable. Then we see that as Evan works, Lawrence shares his frustrations about his past job as a tax collector. Evan provides more details about the connection between Enbridge and Terrio, explaining that their shared terms were arranged by Franz. They then discuss Elsa and Evan's relationship. Evan mentions that Elsa is a kind person who admired Franz before his death. He feels compelled to support Elsa because she provides him with shelter and care. Evan accidentally reveals that Elsa resolved a long-standing issue but doesn't elaborate further. Lawrence returns to the inn and asks Hollow if they should give up on finding the Abbey. It's kinda hilarious how Evan pretty much confirmed that he and Elsa are in a romantic relationship without even realizing it. At the end we see Lawrence express his discomfort with the village and give reasons why they should abandon their information gathering efforts. He then lists several of Hollow's goals, which she doesn't deny. Hollow whispers something to Lawrence, wishing him well. She then suggests they go out to eat. I'm really glad Lawrence is learning from previous mistakes and making things much more clearer with Hollow, because it shows that he is growing as a person, rather than just being dumb, which is great character development. Overall this was a pretty solid episode with good info dump and great character development. By the way, episode 22 should already be out by the time you guys see this. Anyways thanks for watching everyone. If you like my video then check out some of my other videos. Also don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you want to keep me motivated to make more videos, and you can also leave a comment if you want to say something, you can also follow me on Twitter and Instagram or check out my Facebook page, links are given in the description until then see ya.